Hello grade 8 and welcome to the first week of the school year which we will be talking about lesson 1.1 which is the atomic theory. I hope you are all energized and ready to learn. For the first two days of this week we will be breaking the ice. We will get to meet the teacher which is me and then we will go over our classroom rules what you guys are expected to do during this lesson we will watch a video about our classroom rules and then you will be divided into groups and i'll give out cardboard so you can write the main rules and the main points of what you are expected to do in this lesson and then we will watch a video that explains what is science why is it important why do we study science why do we need to learn science what does science help us with how is science embedded in our real life and we will get to learn new things about science that you probably did not know and you will des describe what you learned through a few activities and then we will discuss a very important topic which is climate change it's something very common now. We will watch a video about it. We will do a few activities that will help you know how we can help reduce climate change. As for the objectives of this week, we will understand the development of atomic theories. We have the theory of atom that it started a really long time ago. So we will go through the, the, the levels that it passed through. We will know how the first scientists developed the basic theory. How did the atom start? Where did the theory of atom start? And then we will go through all the developed models that helped us reach the modern atom model. There are a lot of scientists that we will talk about from John Dalton, Rutherford, Thomson, Cloud Model, Nail Bohr Model, all these scientists that discovered a different part of the atom. We will get introduced to these scientists, what they discovered and how they kept on changing the model of the atom until we reached the modern atom model of today and you will be able to differentiate between all the models through history. So we will see a timeline and know how each scientist con contributed to the modern model, model of the atom. For this week's activities, we will practice our knowledge through live worksheets. So as we finish a small part of the lesson, I will share with you live worksheets so you can see what we learned and really let it sink in as this lesson is about the history of models and the development of these theories we will watch a lot of historical videos to know how each model of the atom was discovered we will see how each scientist contributed to the model what each scientist discovered and how he modeled the atom until we reached the modern model of the atom we will also watch simulations of a different atomic model, such as the electron cloud model, so we can get a full picture of the models that we are going to study. We will watch simulations of different models and try to get a full picture of the models, as well as reading articles to help us get the full picture in our lessons, since we're going to take a lot of models so it would be better if we read articles to know how each model was discovered and to know the basic and the main points of each model and to be able to assess our knowledge during this week we will do a lot of online quizzes that i will be sharing with you during the lesson thank you so much eighth grade i hope that you are ready to gain knowledge and learn new things if you need anything during this week please 
let me know. I'm always here to help. Thank you so, so much. Great day.